Philly. Uh, let's tell your fans what you're doing now here in Philadelphia. All right, well, check it out. Let's, let's see. talk about a uh, manifesto. Manifesto Consulting yes. Group. Um, yes. That's a company that um, that I formed with uh, my two other partners, Khalid and and Zaid. And um, as a matter of fact. Um, Right before I came from California, me and my uh, business partner Khalid, who's also lifelong friends, we mm -hmm. went to high school together, mm -hmm. we've known him for more than half my life, mm -hmm. my, my life, and uh, we were working on a movie script together. Mm -hmm. And um, I decided to come back to Philly because things were a little rough, mm -hmm. and um, we decided to build an acting curriculum. Mm -hmm. So we sat down at a wooden table and blasted out this fully comp um, just exhaustive. Uh, curriculum for acting mm -hmm. and because um, we were going to develop um, a uh, performing arts center in the Caribbean that mm -hmm. we had ties to. Okay. So we solidified the company because um, we had a lot of ideas that we wanted to do, a lot mm -hmm. of projects that we wanted to launch and we launched Manifesto Consulting. We have mm -hmm. Actors Institute is the curriculum that we launched and mm -hmm. we also have a hip-hop arts program mm -hmm. created by my partners as well that um that we've launched it's a fully blown out curriculum mm -hmm. teaching the four elements of hip-hop from a culturally aesthetic point of view yes mm -hmm. um how to rhyme how to dance mm -hmm. how you know graffiti and mm -hmm. djing or music production okay yes have you mm -hmm. so when we decided to start it at our freedom theater okay so we got involved with freedom theater and we the hope water. yeah right um so we decided <laughs> to do it in freedom theater mm -hmm. and uh it's going extraordinarily well i'm holding the classes there Go to manifestoconsulting.com and click on Actors Institute if you're mm -hmm. an actor, if you're a hip hopper. Um, the hip hop arts program is also on the website to take a look at. It. Wonderful, wonderful. How do you keep it all together? You're running a business, you're the, the, the actor, you know, that mm -hmm. is on the rise. Like, how do you keep it all intact? Um, you need a couple of different things. Number one, I guess your mind has to be strong. Mm -hmm. You know, you have to be a visionary. Um, have fun at what you do. You got to be passionate about it because mm -hmm. it's a lot of hard work. And um, number two, you got to have a, a, a great staff, man. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? A great, yes, absolutely. Not staff, but a great group of people, mm -hmm. you know, that, that, that supports you, mm -hmm. you know, along the way. And my business partners down there, the greatest. Mm -hmm. You know, they're the greatest. They help me keep, you know, keep things in line because I'm an artist, man. And yeah, absolutely. They're artists too, but I think they're a little bit more like analytical than me at times yes. so they help me balance things out and play and we you know we do that for each other so you know it's uh having a great team mm -hmm. a great staff of people around you to help push you yes and uh, just a that. vision mm -hmm. goal um and faith definitely yes because yes. you got to be able to see the unseen absolutely yes. and then be able to manifest it manifesto yes. consulting okay group. all right you have to have that vision absolutely yes absolutely now tell your fans what projects are you working on uh Let's see, we have a um, project coming up called Pure Shooter with um, uh, Lynn Whitfield, who mm -hmm. played um, Josephine Baker's story. Yes, she also yes. played Martin Lawrence's girlfriend in um, Thin Line Between Love and Hate, mm -hmm. and she's done a, a whole host of things. Clifton Powell, who uh, did Ray with me, and he's in a whole host of things. Uh, uh, James Earl Jones is going to be in the movie. Okay. Uh, Christopher Williams from okay. uh, the, the, the singer guy. Yes, and the light skinned was, pretty boy. Yeah. Yes, Pretty exactly. Mother. From yes, I have liked yes. you anyway. From exactly, uh, yes, uh, uh, New Jack City. There yes. you go. <laughs> yeah, he's yes. going to be in it. Um, yeah, so it's going to be, and we're going to shoot that in North Carolina. We've okay. also, my company, we've also launched a uh, a film production company called Manifesto Films, and we have a couple of projects that we're working on as okay. well. So if you're an actor, producer, holler at us. We're doing big things. We have a couple of scripts in development, yes. and uh, you know we. Uh, have a good, uh, directed a couple of shorts, so mm -hmm. okay. keeping it pushing, man. Trying oh, to put Philly on wonderful. the map. Wonderful, absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. So you're stay, you're here to stay for the most part. This is this my is base, but I'm, I'm, I travel, man. I, yes, mm -hmm. I, I start to get itchy because mm -hmm. I keep my passport in my back pocket. Okay, right. It's not there now, but on me <laughs> all the time, just in case, because uh, I love traveling. I like to mm -hmm. go different places, but Philly's base, Philly's mm -hmm. home. So the the film you're doing in North Carolina, have you started shooting yet, or no? Okay, no, not Is yet. Pre -production we yeah, now? we don't start filming until um, August. I'm out of okay. here second week of August mm -hmm. until the like 
February. I filmed for like four weeks, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and uh, it's a basketball film. Um, so I'm trying to gain a little weight, mm -hmm. get my ball skills up. Okay, you know, okay. Represent Philly to the fullest. So your character actually plays ball. You're yeah, playing, okay. yeah. My character play a Charlie now, Bell. Unlike Ray, you really play ball. Unlike you know the trumpet playing. No, nah, yeah, nah, nah, no, no. Like my Can first. Can you really play ball? My first sport is soccer. I can't front. Okay, okay. But you know, but but basketball, I'm mm -hmm. getting better. You know, okay. I'm, I'm not going to disappoint. I can't look like no fool. Oh, so have you been camera. practicing though? Yeah, yeah. Okay. a lot, okay. a lot, a lot. My J is getting it together. Mm -hmm. My handles are getting together. I always had a quick first step and strong to the hole. Okay, so. where where are you uh, running ball? Um, they have a couple of different parks I like to use. Mm -hmm. One right off of Ridge Avenue, mm -hmm. um, the Allen's. Art Center. They yes, have a nice, I was like, yes, yeah, they have a theater like, there also. Yeah, yes. they, mm -hmm. they sure do. They mm -hmm. sure, and they have a nice brand new um, uh, ball court out there okay. that I go. They mm -hmm. and I have a, a basketball court in the, the driveway of my home. So I try okay. to, You need to yeah. run with some hood brothers that are going to run you up and yeah, down the Yeah, that's court. what Rough House is all yes. about. Yeah, I, I get it playground. in. playground, that's where you need to go. 10th. In Oxford Street. Tenth and Oxford? Yes, which is right down the street from Freedom Theater. Yeah. Right, yeah, yes. Yeah. They will run you. Yeah, definitely. Yes, you need definitely. to run with some young boys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hold on, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Younger boys okay, there, okay? Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> definitely. Toby, I, I want to say thank you for coming into my basement. All right, this is a fresh basement, man. And She uh, has bumper pool tables. <laughs> and a poker table. <laughs> kidding me? Absolutely. And I'm pasta add, upstairs. Oh, you know what? Before we go, would you like to... Uh, you're a musician, right? You a said you bit. play the drums. A little bit. I, I, and the I get keyboards. It or, I get it you want to give us a little something on keyboards before we exit? Yeah, you're a ham. Yeah. Go ahead. <laughs> yeah, That's pretty fresh. Welcome to the basement. 